he, he passed away, you know, and that's hit me hard. So. Welcome, this is going to be my Road to WrestleMania video series. My name is Lee, there's no gimmicks, there's no messing around. This is just me recording my first trip to WrestleMania and how I've come up doing this trip and the reason why it's so emotional and probably the only one I'll go on. But I need to record it because my memory is terrible and I'm going to forget. So if you enjoyed watching it, subscribe, like, um, comment below, let me know how you feel about if you're going to WrestleMania, if you've been to a WrestleMania before. Be great to hear your thoughts and how you felt with it. But this is mine, and this is the start of the road to WrestleMania for me. Really, um, wrestling, wrestling, WrestleMania has always been since I was a kid something I've always loved. You know, you you grown up watching Raw, grown up watching Monday Night Wars, Stone Cold, Steve Austin, Hulk Hogan. You know, you you watched the Rock and Sock Connection. It's it's just something that I've I've grown up with. You know, and over the years it's always been as any wrestling fan, wrestling fan will tell you even if they're AEW, WCW, TNA, Ring of Honor Wrestlemania is, is the pinnacle Wrestlemania is, is the week you want to go to as a wrestling fan you, know, you want to meet the rest of the wrestling fans you want to be part of that family that takes over a city um, in America maybe hopefully one day in the UK but America mainly for one week and this is this is my time you know and it's come about in unfortunate circumstances but you know I've got the, the opportunity to go um, I'm taking it and it's going to be amazing you know um, I'm going to go with my mate Reese, who's from Wales another big wrestling fan but this, this is this is something big this is something special and I hope you know if you watch the videos you, you join this journey with me and um, we'll go into detail as to, as to how I've come about this this video um, yeah Wrestling when I was younger, you know, I used to watch Raw every week. Um, then obviously SmackDown came along, so I'm watching that as well. But you know, seven, ten years old, on at one o'clock in the morning, you weren't exactly awake to watch it. Um, so my dad, bless him, Michael, he he recorded every episode. You know, he he got the old VHS out, got the old video, recorded it for us, um, and we would watch it. Then you know, the next day or the next the next night, we would sit there and watch it. He, he hated wrestling. Well, he said he hated wrestling anyway, but. He kept recording it for me every week and I never missed a show. Pay per views, I'd be up watching. I would watch that early, early hours of the morning. Um, but yeah, he, he made sure I, was, I didn't miss a show. He let the love of wrestling grow um, and become something bigger and better and become part of my childhood growing up. Um, you know, I've got great memories of watching it and, and dad watching it with me. Uh, that brings on to how I'm going to wrestle me this year is February this year, 2019. Um, Dad was rushed into hospital with a heart attack. Um, he was in the hospital for 23 days, never really regained consciousness and, and passed away um, this year. So that was, well, this is now November the 17th. So this is seven months ago he passed away, still sort of kind of dealing with it, still sort of experiencing new things. It's his birthday next month. Um, but yeah, he, he passed away, you know, and that's hit me hard. So. With his passing away, you know, he left a little bit of money to, to me and my brother and sisters. Um, and I've used that money throughout the year to, to get pay off debts, uh, move into a new flat for me and my children. Um, and I was left with this bit of money and I needed something to do. Something that I'm going to remember. Something that's going to be a lifetime. And I was talking to my mate, I was like, WrestleMania, once in a lifetime trip. We're going all out, we're going to travel package. Um, it was just something I had to do. Something Dad knew, would know that I would love doing. Something the memories would last a lifetime with, and something that I could, you know, look back on and go, yeah, you know, Dad, Dad knew he'd won that trip. You know, so he may not be here, but he's he's certainly paying um, for this trip. Thank you, Dad, um, and making this happen. So Tampa, Florida, is where I'm heading to for WrestleMania 36 with Reese. Um, I say, what time is the cabinet? You've got the smoking school title on top. Once again, we've got that from Taz money as well. So he certainly made sure that every aspect of this this trip is possible. Um, I've got pictures of my dad in the cabinet back there, which I'll show you as well in a bit. Bless him. Um, but yeah, so that's that's why I'm going to WrestleMania. That's why it's such an emotional trip. It's not just me going to WrestleMania. It's the last big gift from my dad. You know, the money that he left is now gone. 
um, and it's all gone on this trip. Um, I've done things for my kids, I've made sure they've had good times this year, but this time it's for me um, and for my dad. That's, that's why WrestleMania is happening. So where are we at at the minute? Where are we at? Well, we've, we've got the flights. We've booked the flights. We're off to Tampa the 1st of April. Um, we waited patiently from November, November the 5th, which took quite a while for the travel packages to go on sale. There were lots of if and anami. Do we get travel packages? Do we do it individually? We read lots of reviews online and things like that. So, oh God, man, you know, do we save a bit of money? Do we do single packages? Do we go all out as our first one? Do the travel package just to take the stress out of it? Um, there was a lot of to and fro, a lot of to and fro. In the end, we decided, you know what? It's our first trip. It's probably going to be the only one we may do. If we do a future one, we'll, we'll look at doing it individually, maybe. But this one, we we went for the travel package. So we've gone for gold. You know, we've gone for the gold package. Good seats from reading by it, but well, hopefully, but we with the gold package, we get the Hall of Fame. Which God forbid, I'm really hoping maybe something like the Undertaker. But you know, I'm pushing my belt out of there. I've never seen the Undertaker live. But I'm hoping with WrestleMania week I get to at least witness his, his entrance. You know, I've watched wrestling since he debuted and, and moved on, you know, from there. His, his streak, everything about the Undertaker is just incredible. So fingers crossed I get to see the Undertaker in this WrestleMania week as well. So we get Hall of Fame on the Thursday. Friday, we now get Friday night SmackDown. Um, so that should be a lot of people sort of moaning about that this year. Um, you know, SmackDown's before WrestleMania. But in my eyes it's gonna be a big show. You know, it's it's the last show that WWE have before WrestleMania. You know, it's the going home show. It's a night before takeover. Uh, with everything that AEW is going on in it, which is putting on some incredible shows. Um, the SmackDown before WrestleMania, I think, is going to be huge. It's going to be big. Um, so yes, I'm looking forward to that. Friday night is going to be takeover. We all know takeover is going to be incredible. You know, it's sometimes takeover has been better than WrestleMania in recent years. So we know the shows will be great. Um, I'm hoping maybe Velveteen Dream might be there in a main event match. Um, that would be incredible because he's, he's incredible. Maybe Johnny Gargano, you know, if he's, he's available to as well. Um, maybe, you know, make that happen. That'd be great. You know, Velveteen Dream, Johnny Gargano, some kind of match would be incredible. Um, and then, what's that? On the Sunday night then is WrestleMania in the Raymond James Stadium. 75,000 strong. It's just going to be incredible. It really is, isn't it? It's, it's just going to be out of this world. Never been to America, never been to a WrestleMania, um, not been to a pay-per-view, you know, been to Raw, SmackDown Live here in the UK, but never been to, to a big pay-per-view. So it's certainly going to be an incredible experience, just that in itself. Monday night, we move on to Raw. Um, Monday night, Monday Raw after WrestleMania, crowd always lives, always ruckus, lots of surprises tend to happen, so I'm looking forward to that as well. Um, it's going to be an incredible event. Tuesday at the moment we're looking at booking a tattoo uh, to commemorate the trip to really sort of seal the memory in there um, just a WrestleMania logo something small but something that that be like yeah you know that's our, our memory of it you know as well as this video that I'm doing for my own personal sort of remembrance and, and to put on YouTube um, so I can look back on it whenever I need to and whenever I feel I need that thank you dad moment really um, yeah, and then we'll, we'll fly back on the Wednesday. We're from Wednesday to Wednesday, so we've got a couple of days there without any wrestling. Um, we've also also forgot about the access. We've got WWE access. Looking forward to experiencing that. We've watched a few of the YouTube videos of people vlogging it. You know, Izzy Mania on there. Uh, for one of them we watched. It's always quite funny watching her because she walks in and all the wrestlers know her anyway. Um, but yeah, it looks like a, an incredible um, experience. The whole thing, what we've seen so far. So that's that's where we are. We've got the tickets. We've got the flights. Um, it's now just a waiting game. Yeah. What's next? What's next? We've got what we now November seventeenth. So in December we get an email to say what hotel we're going to be staying in. Um, not quite sure where it's going to be. Obviously somewhere in Tampa. A lot of events are around. I don't know how to pronounce. I think it's the Amalai Arena. Amalai, Amalai. Please correct me in the comments. Um, Amalai Arena. So I'm hoping the hotels are around there. You know, not quite sure what transport's like in Tampa. Um, but you know, we get around, we look walking, so if it's a bit of distance, we'll walk our way there. Um, but yeah, so that's what's next. December is is when we find out the hotel, because January is when we book access sessions. We've got to choose our two sessions for access. Uh, and then we always March, where we get our travel package turn up. Um, and that's going to be the exciting one. Definitely going to be some kind of video unboxing it then. Um, it's got everything in it. It's got the seats, it's got an itinerary, it's got 
it's just that's when it gets real. You're four weeks away from WrestleMania, you got your package arrive, suddenly it's all there, it's all kicking in, you're off to WrestleMania. And um, it's still something that really isn't gonna settle in until I'm there. I'm sure I'm probably gonna have a few tears there. You know, I'm, I'm taking that, I don't know if you can see it behind me, um, on the Bill Shankly statue there. I've got a little necklace um, with a little bit of Dad's ashes in I'm hoping to take with me because he's never been abroad. Um, I'm gonna spread his ashes around somewhere in America because he's never been on holiday. I want to take him on holiday um, and take him on this trip with me. So I've got to look into how I'm gonna do that. I'm not quite sure what restrictions are with something like that and traveling to America. Um, but yeah, I've got to look into that and do that as well. Yeah, so that's it for, for the first video. What I'm gonna try and do, I'm gonna see how it goes. But I'm gonna so keep an eye on the wrestling and maybe little update videos on how I'm feeling about WrestleMania as we get closer. Um, as announcements are made for WrestleMania, Hall of Fame, matches are set up. Uh, I'll do little sort of catch up videos and, and keep it up to date. Let me know if there's anything you would like me to do um, that will help me sort of document this this journey along the way. Um, this is a big thing for me, so you know I want to try and capture everything possible, and everything will be raw. You know I'm not gonna gimmick it up. I'm not gonna be fancy in any way. It's just gonna be me talking truthfully to, to the camera um, about this trip and how much this means to me. Um, I would have done it on my own, but it's great. I've got my friend Reese going. He's from Wales. Um, same love of wrestling, you know, it's it's going to be a good trip, so yeah, I'm looking forward to it. So, this is my Road to WrestleMania video, um, a series. Um, join me along the way, and if you're in Tampa, Florida for WrestleMania, I'll see you there. I'm going to try and make sure I'm wearing a bright shirt at WrestleMania, so maybe you've seen me on TV. Um, but hey, we're all wrestling fans dreaming of, of something like that, so thank you very much. I'll see you for this video, and I'll see you soon. Cheers. Yeah.